Hey everybody, Jay Marino here. Welcome back. We're playing 007 GoldenEye for Nintendo 64, emulated on 1964. We're going to the lush jungles of Cuba today. In the movie, she claims that he's in Havana, but instead we're in a, the middle of a jungle somewhere. Destroy drone guns. Eliminate Xenia. Blow up ammo dump. Escort Natalia to Giannis' base. This is another one where it's your, your vision is sort of obscured and the draw distance is really low, so mm, hopefully we find what we need. We gotta destroy all these guns. That's a good spin move, you see that? Okay, so we can use those mines for the ammo dump. Right, so Natalia will actually help us this time. And she will follow us around. And I think we have to destroy all these boxes. I think that's the whole ammo dump thing. Like, there's a room with a bunch of them later. But I think you have to destroy all of these ones along the way. I may be wrong about that. An AR-33 assault rifle. Let's wait till we get some more of those. Get some more ammo. Okay, so if we have a general idea of where it is. There we go, it's gone. This thing has some serious zoom range on it, which I appreciate. Did take some damage, but that's alright. This is another one, too, where it's like, you kind of have to know where they are. Dude, that guy, look at the camouflage. Maybe you shouldn't be wearing blue helmets. That would probably help with the camouflage. Nice shot. She just one-shots these motherfuckers with the, with the Magnum. So we're like, we sort of are escorting her. See, there's another one. I can see it. It's got to be on the lookout for those. It's also a little weird because I think this is the only mission where they have these assault rifles. And also, there's a guy who's dual-wielding them, so you kill him and then you can dual-wield them, which is just so absurd. Look at this weapon. <laughs> More body armor. I must not have gotten hit since then. So let's just use the AR-33. I see it. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty sure it's an objective to destroy all those. And then Xenia comes out with a grenade launcher, so she's, you know, a pain in the ass. She's right here, actually. I, th I thought she was right here. The, the music. Because she, uh, she, she, she has an RCP-90 and also a grenade launcher. So if she shoots you with the grenade launcher, you're just totally screwed. There's the RCP-90. Very satisfying weapon to use. Though not a lot of ammunition for it, unfortunately. You can dual wield these as well. well I guess we're using the PP-7. It's like, was that a person or was that a, a turret? Yeah, just, <laughs> I can't stress enough. Ha being able to use twin, oh, there it is, yeah. Being able to use twin stick to, to dodge enemies, like you can lure them around terrain and stuff, just makes this absurdly easy. And I'm still failing at times, but it's usually because the missions are are goofy more than anything else. Uh, let's check back here. I think this is where the, uh, the ammo dump is. Uh, 
Well, hand grenades should work pretty well. Uh, okay. <laughs> I'm like, I'm pretty sure this is where it is. What's, it, what's up the ladder then? I see you. I see that hand grenade too. Ooh! Ooh! It was a trap! Actual human gods setting a trap. I'm out of ammo. I have nothing. I have actually nothing. Get him to tell you. Oh, I've got a I've got a grenade launcher. I'm gonna kill myself with it. I, I had no I had no ammunition. Alright, well I guess we have to be extremely careful with our ammo. That back there was the um the ammo dump. I really should I should watch the death it's the death scenes. It's so funny to just watch yourself die like four times in a row. So let's maybe be a little more diligent with our AR ammo. Not today, asshole. Get a little closer. Can't quite see it. I'll zoom in. Damn it. All right, I wasted two bullets. You see that? Can't afford to. Ha can't afford that. There's body armor back here. <laughs> Who? Where? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> She's great, you know. Is there another turret here? I think I see a guy. There was another turret there. I mean, I could save ammo by letting Natalia shoot everything. Doesn't seem like the smartest choice, but I'm just saying, you can. Oh my god. More body armor? Sure. Sure. Watch Xenia kill me this time because with the with the grenade launcher. What? Ultra camouflaged. Okay. And then here she is. Do 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 the music. Ah! Come across the bridge, you coward. God damn it. <laughs> I told you! I told you she was gonna get me. I should just use the- I was too concerned about using the AR-33. I should have just used it and killed her quickly. Because the stopping power of that is so much higher. We can kill her very fast. Alright, so let's- let's- let's get serious, alright? One. Two, three. There's the turret. Goodbye. 
Got it. Just in case. I, I actually don't think that those are required, but we'll do, again, just in case. Did I miss the body armor? Okay. Well, I'm going to regret saying whatever, but whatever. I'm burning through my uh, PP7 ammo a lot faster this time. Ooh! Anytime Natalia gets a kill, it's exciting. Good roll. He did dodge several bullets, so it really was. I'm not even being sarcastic. What a god. Two bullets. Got him! Again. You think I would know by now where those were? All right. Zinnia time. And then there's the turrets. That's right, you fucking asshole. Take your stupid music and get out of here. Uh, okay, let's go. It is surprisingly challenging to see these guys. Okay, I think I have enough ammunition now to get through that last room, but that last room has like a million guys in it. Oh, yeah. That's efficiency right there, baby. Okay. Now, let's maybe not get caught by the trap of that auto turret this time. That we know is around the corner here. Not this corner, but the next corner. We know there's like a million guys in this room. Fine. You know what? Fine. Too much smoke. Still have body armor. Okay, I think we did it. Lovely. That's gone. That's why you don't climb up the ladder. Do these guys maybe spawn after we turn the corner? It's possible. Get out of here. How many are there? That's the end. That's the end elevator right there. We just have to go and blow up the stockpile. Careful, Natalia. All right. I did. I, I blew it up. Hang on, let's check the objectives. Okay, that's it. Good. Oh. 
the heck was that? Oh, I ran out of ammunition. I'm like, did it, did it do like an auto melee when you run into range? I didn't think that this game did that. Natalia. Natalia, where is she? Oh, no. You know what? Let's end it and just assume that it'll work. Maybe. Please. Yes, okay. She showed up in the in the cutscene. I skipped it. I'm so sorry, everybody. Protect Natalia. Disable Golan. I said this one blows. This one blows so hard because there's so many turrets. The armed guards spawn out of nowhere when Natalia is hacking a computer in the middle of an open room. It's just the worst. Wait here in the lift, Natalia. I'll secure the area. Yep, I remember that. I remember how to play it. I know how it happens. Dude. I'm not fucking around with double O agent uh, control, alright? It's like the hardest mission in the game. Oh, there's another one! Oh, game! Oh, you got me. You got me. I'll... I, it, you know what? It, it got me. It got me. I can't even be mad about that one. Yeah, let's watch ourselves get mowed down from multiple angles. All right. There we go. We may just take some damage that we can't help. There we go. And there's another one up here. That one up there is probably the worst just because it's far away and it's you, you can't get an angle on it that'll take it out quickly. Whoa, 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 whoa. Every bit of damage has to be mitigated on this map. Okay. Hello? James, you were wonderful. You didn't even see. What do you know? All right. So she's gonna open the door. I think this is the escape path later, if I remember correctly. Yeah, it's locked, that's fine. The blast doors have been locked by the security computer. Wamp, 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 wamp. Got one open. Head for the control room, James. I'll do what I can from here. Good, so we don't have to... You don't have to babysit her until later. I don't know if the enemy accuracy gets better or worse with range. I think it's worse. Oh, come on. That was square in the face. I guess getting shot in the face is not necessarily a death sentence. Though, it would certainly be very unpleasant. Remote mines? I don't know what those would be needed for. I'm conserving my ammunition, though. That just seemed a little silly. Maybe just to show I could have played like this all along and I never did. I think that's where that might be where Natalia is. I'm not sure. It's a good roll. It's a good roll. All right, this is where shit gets real. Was is this room? I mean, not right now, but it will. I'm not going to speak to Boris yet. I have better things to do. So, what? don't I need to do something with these? 
Destroy armored mainframes. So that's why we need to use the remote mines. That's one. Don't mind me, I just look after the computers. Dog, I know what you're up to. You don't want to kill him though, I don't think. Oh, great. Uh, okay, that, those are gone. I think Boris just sets off an alarm later. So again, I'm just gonna keep clearing this out. I'll deal with Boris and all that later. And then I have to figure out how to let Natalia in. I think she just gets triggered to come because Boris sets off an alarm, I think. I don't I don't know. Let's just let's go and let's go and just keep doing this. Okay. Sure. There's gotta be, I think, I don't know how many there are, honestly. Let's just go this way. Whoop, nope. There we go. There's another one too. I know that because it was in the cutscene. Do you take me for a fool? Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, you can take me for a fool. I understand. That makes sense. Ah! Ah, they're on both sides! I suspected there was one. But two... There we go. I definitely forgot about those. Body armor, no body armor. The damage taken here in this room may be a little too much. We'll see. All right. I'm not sure what was up with Boris, to be honest. It's possible that he sets off alarms. Did I not, did I not blow all these up? That was the last one, wasn't it? There must be more. Maybe we have to go and talk to Natalia? I I don't I don't remember. I think we needed Boris for something, honestly. I probably should have interacted with him straight away. Doors locked. Uh. Hmm. Okay. Might have to restart here because I blew it. It's locked. Yeah, because I think you need him to open something. I'm just going to restart. I should have. I, I avoided him. I should have just interacted with him straight away. All right, let's get fucked by auto turrets some more, hey? Let's go. It's eerie how I remember doing this so many times. This beginning section, so many times. So strap in, we're gonna be doing it so many times again. That is so much HP that that takes off. Oh my god. Okay. 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 Natalia. I've taken a little too much damage, I think. 
Yeah, no shit. Oh, I guess she says, like, oh, James, you are wonderful if you take no damage. I guess we weren't wonderful this time, eh? Alright, pop the door, girl. Let's go. Boom, boom. Come on. There you go. Pop the button. That's the other thing, is you gotta wait for these scripted events a bunch. The enemies, I don't think, actually have clips. They don't have to deal with the clips. Ah! There's, like, no way. I'm just gonna... <laughs> I'm just gonna restart now. Again, and imagine doing this without twin sticks. This was just absurd, if I remember correctly. This one, this one was really rough. You gotta do it just right so that you can see the, the side of the turret. where it can't actually hit you. Like, this one right here is rough. I found the spot. Alright, I think I found the spot. We can abuse that going forward. And then this one is right around the corner. So the first one might actually be the hardest. No, 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 no. James, you were wonderful. You're goddamn right. Do you think I need to stand by her? Or she'll open the blast door herself? Let's try it. Just shout to me from across the room, Natalia, I can hear you. She's not gonna. Yep. I wonder if you, like, you move away... And you go back. No. Back away. Go back. Yeah, okay. Jay Barino's getting serious. One of these guys throws a grenade. Or at least has a grenade. So we have to be cognizant of that. Alright, we get some extra remote mines. Alright, I was being real diligent about shooting these guys each individual in the head to spare ammunition, and now we're just mowing through them. Sure. Oh, he didn't roll. That's the guy that rolled initially. He was my favorite. I'll take a hop. A hop is acceptable. Hello? Right, and then he tries to pull the gun. Please don't shoot. Trevelyan made me do it. It's possible that we... Had to do this? And then he runs. We may have had... The thing is, if you kill him, then Natalia's mad and you fail the mission. At least I'm pretty sure. And then he runs through the grate. You can't... You can follow him. There's body armor. Secrets. Bump. Okay, so I have to remember how to progress this. Obviously, we have to destroy all the mainframes. We haven't taken any damage, and we have body armor now, so that's a big positive. So let's go around and set all these up. How about this one? Yep, there's Natalia. No, it's not. I'm coming, James. 
Yeah, you are, you sick bitch. <laughs> All right, so now we know what we had to open to get her here. Next step is I have to go and get the last... I have to go and get the last uh, mainframe. I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have let her out so early. Well, maybe we can do this in time. I don't know. Oh, we can outrange them. Okay, that's a big positive. She's about to get attacked. So let's throw this. Blow them all up. And then get back there, because she's going to come under attack here very soon. So we have to stand here and make sure that she doesn't get killed, which, is, if I remember correctly, is very challenging. That's the hardest part of the... of the thing. Because of this. Now, this is where the twin sticks may come into... real... Handy. But if I remember correctly, they pretty much go straight for her. Someone's shooting and I don't know from where. I think they're behind the they're behind the wall. Make an ammo run. I'm giving you cover. Shut your mouth. See, some of them are a little too stupid, which is a really good thing. I don't remember how long this lasts. Oh, really? Okay, so this is what I was saying. Pain in the butt. And it's unclear to me how long this is supposed to go for and how long you have to do it. So I'll make I'll make a cut till I get back here again so that you don't have to sit through the beginning of the mission. Alright, once more with feeling. Let's see how it goes. See, I may be able to stop them from from this direction entirely. The hardest are the ones that, that spawn on the sides. Well, they don't spawn on the sides, but they'll run to the sides. I don't think he hit her. It's like I saw that one that just went down there. They're gonna break one of the sides. Those are the worst ones, or the most dangerous ones, I should say. I'm stopping a lot of them from getting down. Eventually, it's going to be an issue with uh, ammunition, though. I don't care if they're hitting me, it's if they hit Natalia. I've got body armor currently. This is working. Okay. It, those guys that run down the stairs are the ones that go to the sides. Those are the worst ones. Come on, Natalia. Come on, girl. This ain't a fucking game. Let's go. Well, it is a game. It's quite literally a game. That did it. The satellite's in orbit. The satellite's orbit is decaying.
Get back to the surface. Good luck, James. I'll be waiting for you. Okay, so she's no longer a liability, I don't think. Let's go and grab some ammunition. These enemies may continue to spawn. I'm not sure. I have to go and find the remainder of the mainframes. Here's all the ammunition. Let me double check that the mainframes were indeed destroyed. Okay, that wasn't that bad. The key was to just keep them bottlenecked on these stairs. I thought more spawned on the bottom floor. And if they spawn on the bottom floor... You're gonna have a hell of a time stopping them from getting you surrounded on those side windows. But that, yeah, ultimately that wasn't that bad. As a kid, I didn't really understand the concept of how, like, where enemies spawn from and where to bottleneck them, etc, etc. I mean, I probably did, that's how I beat it, but... I'm just double-checking that, again, these all got properly destroyed, because I really don't want to do this again. Um, there may be save states with this emulator, if there are, I don't know what, you know, how to use them. I should just look it up, that would make this so much better. Uh, bombs away. Let's see if that properly did. It did destroy the mainframe. Okay, so that's multiple mainframes down. It's just the enemies are going to keep spawning forever. So let's see if we can actually complete this. Um, I do know that we've got this now. I, sus I think this is the way out. Honestly, I don't know. Body armor. That's great. I actually think the exit is simply back at the beginning. I think it's the same elevator that we came in on. That loops, that loops us around. Got plenty of ammunition, so let's just play it cool. Okay, that was Trevelyan. At this point, I'm just looking for the last set of mainframes. If there's, you know, one or more or what, but... So this was just a big loop. So let me double check. Oh no, I did it. Okay, we can leave. <laughs> what am I doing? I, I, it must have gotten the pop-up that said we did complete it at some point. I didn't notice it. Okay, control is completed, and I think every mission after this is nowhere near as challenging. Uh, I, I guess that, you know, that and jungle can be its own video. <laughs> that was a tricky one. Destroy inlet pump controls, outlet pump controls, master control console, use radio to contact Jack Wade, minimize scientist casualties. I don't know how long I've been recording, honestly, because I had to play this a couple times. So I guess we'll just call it quits here. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye now.